this motherfucker. Ask your bitch who win it. Yeah, man, let's go into this Mason Fabio foreign thing, man. Uh, this thing got hectic this week. This has been a serious topic. I'll get a breakdown real quick. Uh, Fabio Foreign, this conversation has came up before where he signed to Mace for $5,000, a $5,000 advance. This was actually a group deal where he signed him and some other guys, but they were supposed to get $5,000 apiece uh, on the deal. Fabio had said that he got $5,000 before <laughs> when he signed to Mace, and it became out public and everything of that nature. $5,000? And uh, last week, <laughs> Fabio went on to million dollars worth the game and told Wallow and Gilly sign, sign for 5K. Wallow was like, really? Like, wow. hold on, man. He running around here talking, what? Like, because, you know, niggas be calling out they old label execs. Yeah, because he, he been on Diddy. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Just, so bro, that's what I, yeah. they was on that. And yeah. so Mace had explained before, like months ago, how everything went happy, how it went down. He he signed him to the 5K, but he eventually worked out a deal with him. He didn't take none of his 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 his, his uh like he didn't 360 him basically on the deal when they went to the label. He helped them negotiate a bigger deal for the label. Everybody got paid and everything. That's what he was saying like months ago. Okay. So after this went viral this time, Mace now went on me and Dodge worth the game this week to tell his side of the story. Right. So I'm gonna let y'all hear this. And then we'll come back and speak on it. This is what he said on Million Dollars Worth of Game when he went on there. When we went in the building, I took eight hundred. He took seven hundred thousand. Now the reason why it went down to seven hundred thousand is because when I gave him seven fifty and I took seven fifty, he owed me fifty thousand. So I, why he owe you fifty thousand for all the money that I was spending until he got the deal? Uh, okay. He gave him. I gave him all of his percentages back. What you mean? All of them. So if he was going to tour, I could have made thirty percent for the rest of my life on everything he did. Mm -hmm. I gave thirty percent all back to him. Mm. Okay. Before the seven fifty, so he got seven fifty and the thirty back. Mm. Okay. What about his publishing? I never had any of his publishing. So when niggas say my deal is like a Puff Daddy deal, how? I got zero publishing. Mm. I got zero merchandising. Mm. I got zero touring. Lord. And we just split everything like partners. So why did I sign him to that deal? So that when we go in the door, nobody could rip us off because when the artists don't understand the business you will work them up to a certain point and then they'll get in and sell everybody out for the little yeah, that, that type of contract because there's, there's a lot of dudes mm -hmm. that put a bunch of money into artists out here and when the artist sign they dip on them what is the name of that contract that what, what is the title of that the, so you I, can make sure you can I, settle your money what i did was i just signed them as an artist in a group but i put it where all the terms was on my side where I can make the decision. The decision make it within the So country. when I make the decision, I would have money and masters. Mm -hmm. So we got money and masters. So you own the masters? That's another conversation. Oh. <laughs> oh, they fight. He lost me right there. See, okay. that, 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 was, See? that was what I was talking about earlier. Yeah, he, right lost, there. he lost me right there. I want to paint out a couple more things All before right. y'all speak on it. Okay. For, to make bring to the people and everybody. When Fabio Foreign says, I signed the Mace for 5000 Mace says, no, I, you, I signed him for, I gave him seven fifty. Right. I signed him for five. dollars mate, when he sold, Fabio Foreign says, man, yeah, I signed the Mace for 5000 I blew that money in a couple weeks. It was gone. Like, duh, duh, duh. that's what he said. Mace said, that's a lie, basically. I signed you for seven fifty. Um, now that right there is already shaky, but then Mace did say this. I tried to put him on shows. He didn't show up to the shows because his enemies were booked, uh, 22 G's and other Brooklyn artists that do drill Brooklyn were on the same shows. So he said he didn't go to the shows. He said he took them shopping before. 
and he said he was came in, to the studio in Atlanta, said I gave him, showed him how to kind of create songs and everything of that nature. So when you hear all of this, and I'm going to give my, my take, but when you hear this, what do you think, bro, when you hear all this shit? What's the main thing that stood out to you here? Because it's viral right now. Fabio Four now posted the contract up. Mm-hmm. Oh, he did? Oh. Yeah. What I think, I, shit. <laughs> what he say? That's a different conversation. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, man. Uh, it's basically he say, he say until, you know, more evidence is put out there. I, 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 unless he read nothing in the paperwork, I doubt that he signed. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't think he just gave him 5000 No, he um, said, no, he didn't read his paperwork. He, he said he did. He, did, he didn't read his paperwork so he, and both, he took both 5, parties. Thousand. Both parties agreed on the 5000 Yeah. He's saying so, I gave him, I gave him 5000 but I really gave him 750000 Right. But Fabio saying he didn't. Basically, and this is how it goes. Because that, 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 that kind he of kind of confused. Okay, me, okay. Like, that's what I think a lot of people is confused at. Yeah. What you want to say, Pokey, before I start talking? Because I got to explain all yeah, this shit. I, I'm From what you know, what you... Okay. Break, break it down. Cause okay. I'm, this is what happened, basically. May, May saw some artists. He wanted to sign one artist. Okay. But when he went there, it was multiple artists there. And the guy that he was going to sign, I forgot his name. Shout out to him. He introduced them to five. He like, yeah, man, sign my dude, too. Okay. Went in his pocket, threw them some bands as a group. Actually gave them to a manager. They say the manager never paid them, but Fabio's never said anything about not getting paid that five thousand, whatever. That's the five thousand is understood. Okay, yeah, right, right. Mace is saying I signed him for the seven fifty because they would not negotiated that deal with the label. You didn't, you didn't get. He said I gave him seven fifty. You didn't give him seven fifty, nigga. Nah, and yeah. that's what niggas need to understand. For nah. y'all niggas who don't get it, mm-hmm. big ant from the real world. Nigga, if you didn't go in your pocket and give me seven hundred fifty thousand, yeah. don't go in no interview and say you gave me seven fifty, nigga. On, that seven fifty came off of my talent. What nobody finna give you seven hundred and fifty thousand dollars exactly. off of your talent? Exactly. They gave you that because I was a hot artist. Bust his money down. I gave you got a piece of money off of my talent. Yes, you might have had some relationships. Yes, you know how to might have talked to them at the label. Right. But you got paid off of that nigga talent, not because you mace. True. The label's not yeah. giving you, so he said that he got seven hundred, I got seven fifty. So that's basically, you know, I guess about one point five on the deal. He say say eight hundred. Eight hundred and seven fifty. Yeah, yeah. Well, 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 he well really seven fifty, seven fifty. Then he's supposed to keep fifty. 50. Yeah, he said he owed him. So 50. they got one point five on the deal. Right, one point five. He said I gave him all his publishing. Which is honorable. That stand up because he could have okay. kept it. He could have kept it. Yeah, true. So what you're telling me? He said I gave him his publishing back. I gave him his touring back. I gave him us uh, all that back. So that means you signed him to a contract where you owned him outright. Right. Everything he made, you owned it. He said he he he, he said he made it clear that yeah. the decision making he yeah. he he had the contract. Yeah. You know what I'm saying to where he was making all the decisions. Yeah. But if you got to give me my everything back, that means in the contract, it was I forfeited all that to you. Right, right, right. Like you could call it the decision making, whatever. You signed me to a contract knowing in your head I own everything about this nigga. Right. Mm-hmm. So if he would have never made for $5, it for $5,000. Now, you did yeah. stand up and did the honorable thing because you could have jerked the mo, right. but then the conversation comes of masters. Mm-hmm. Hey, and that nigga in the comments, I saw you earlier. You not smart as you think you are, nigga. No, facts. I was you think that you that are shit. smart. I you not that smart. Shit. I see that shit. You are not smart, nigga. <laughs> Mace didn't have 750 to get that nigga. Mace can't go get um, $1.5 million from nobody, nigga, right now. Facts. If he don't have a nigga with talent. It's true. The reason why Fabio Ford got that deal is because Brooklyn Drill scene took off. Come on. Uh-huh. 
The question he asked Mace right there on the phone was, hey, my nigga, what did you put into me? Right. Mace said it don't matter. It does, though. When it comes to being a man and being of the culture and being a brother and solid and genuine, that's what matters. Exactly. On paperwork, it don't matter. Right. right. On paperwork, right. Mace did great business on paperwork. On paperwork, Mace did exactly what he supposed to do. Fuck him hard, fuck him long, and fuck him strong. Pause. That's what they do. That's the business. That's just, yeah, that's the nature of the business. Yeah. Business ain't fair. Business is business. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. He, he did what he supposed to do, but when it comes to, man, you kept it solid, or you kept it real, or you did me dirty, you did me wrong, that's a different conversation.